Kurtoskalix Hungarian KYRTO stroke klati listen sometimes transliterated kurtosh kalach is a spit cake specific to Hungary and Hungarian speaking regions in Romania more predominantly the CK land Earlier a festive treat, now it is part of everyday consumption. Kurtoskalix is made from sweet, yeast dough, raised dough, of which a strip is spun and then wrapped around a truncated cone shaped baking spit, and rolled in granulated sugar. It is roasted over charcoal while basted with melted butter, until its surface cooks to a golden brown color. During the baking process, the sugar stuck on the Kurtoskalix caramelizes and forms a shiny, crispy crust. The surface of the cake can then be topped with additional ingredients such as ground walnut or powdered cinnamon. Etymology The etymology of the name refers to a stovepipe, since the fresh, steaming cake in the shape of a truncated cone resembles a hot chimney. This opinion is shared by Attila T. Zabo, scholar and philologist from Kolesvar when cake is taken off from the spit in one piece, it gets the shape of a 25 to 30 cm (9.8 to 11.8 inch) long vent or tube. Since cake preserves shape when served for both family and guests, consumers are faced with this typical vent-like image of cake tearing off in strips. It is obvious that etymology must be closely related to the vent shape of cake. Throughout the centuries, miscellaneous alternate names and spellings of Kurtoskalix have been used. More references were mentioned even in the 19th century, e.g., Durongfunk, Spit Donut or Botratekirx, Stick Roll Up or Botfank, Stick Donut. The name Kurtoskalix has a Transylvanian origin and became popular only by the middle of the 20th century. Until the end of the century it had different spellings e.g. spelt with o as in kurtos kalax or in two words as in kurtos kalax as far as we know the present name kurtoskalix first appeared in a cookbook published by the book department of brasoy lapak transylvanian gazette of the time in 1926 the international kurtoskalix trade corporation has taken measures to have kurtoskalix registered as hungarian product by the european union History The first known record that hints at a family of cakes baked by rotating spit over cinders dates back to medieval times about 1450 and is found in a manuscript from Heidelberg. The description mentions a strip of raised dough that has to be wound in a helix shape around a baking spit, and brushed with egg yolk before baking. In the 16th century, the evolution of the cake family proceeded in three branches. The first branch contains pastries that preserved the image of cake similar to the one mentioned above, with a strip wound on spit in a helical shape. The Sekler Hungarian Kurtoskalix, Skaliki Tridelnik, Tridelnik from Skalica, and the Czech Moravian Trdlo, Tridelnis, Tridelnik, which is virtually the same as the latter, as well as the Kurtosfank Kurtosh donut belong to this branch. The second branch has pastries made from batter, namely the Lithuanian ragwolis and sakotis, Polish sekic, the French gâteau à la broche, the German bomkachen, the Austrian prugertorte and prugelkropfen as well as the Swedish spetakaka. The third branch is represented by one cake, the Transylvanian Saxon baumstriesel, where a continuous dough strip is placed on a spit. The first known recipe of Kurtoskalix originates from Transylvania, included in the 1784 cookbook of Countess Maria Mikes of Zabola, Kurtos Kalats a la Mrs. Porani. It makes no mention, however, of sweetening of any kind in the preparation. A recipe from the cookbook written by Christoph Samai in 1795 in Upper Hungary present-day Slovakia first mentioned, sweetening subsequent to baking. Tradelnik from Skalica is based on similar preparation, with the cake surface covered in chopped nuts e walnut, almond, before baking, and sugar that is added only subsequent to baking. Almost 100 years passed before the first mention was made of the next step in the evolution of Kurtoskalix, the appearance of a caramelized sugar glaze, in Aunt Rezi's cookbook written by Terezia Dolchko in 1876, published in Seged, Hungary. The recipe suggests sprinkling sugar, sugar almond on dough on spit a priory to baking". Due to the heat, the sugar is caramelized and also enters in what is known as Maillard reaction. 
The sugar glaze that melts to become caramel forms a continuous coat, also adds to firmness of cake. Shortly afterwards, pure sugar, not almond sugar was applied to the dough's surface before baking, even with the omission of sweetening subsequent to baking. Agnes Zalahi's cookbook entitled Velody Magyar Zakakskanov The Real Hungarian Cookbook, which appeared in Budapest in 1892, presents such a recipe. The first mention of additional toppings applied to the caramel glaze appears in Rezi Neni Zakakskanov Aunt Rezi's cookbook. The use of ground, chopped or candied walnuts applied as an additional topping became popular only in the late 20th century. As far as we know Paul Covey's cookbook, Erdei Lakoma Transylvanian Feast, which came out in 1980, seems to be the first source with the tip of applying this type of topping. The wide spectrum of cinnamon, coconut, cocoa, etc. toppings started to receive wide application only at the end of the century. The current, most frequently baked variant of Kurtoskalix evolved in Seklerland in the first half of the 20th century. It is specific to this variant that the surface of the raw dough wrapped around the spit flattens out by the usual procedure of rolling it on a flat surface sprinkled with granulated sugar. By this procedure the layers of dough wrapped around the spit are pressed together, rendering the cake smoother, more compact in structure and more elegant. The first written record of this technique appears in the cookbook of Mrs. Zatharecki, Ne Mansi Zilek, which was published in Barrow between 1934 and 1943. The cookbook, entitled Erdei Isaac Flavors of Transylvania, which appeared in Chicxereta Schickleberg, Mercuria Ciuc, published by Proprint Press in 2007, gives a recipe of this sort. Spread Kurtoskalix became popular among the Hungarian nobility at the beginning of the 18th century. One hint at an Austrian or German origin is the fact that a conservative Transylvanian nobleman, Pater Apor, in his work Metamorphosis Transylvania does not mention Kurtoskalix in the list of traditional Hungarian foods, for all the evidence we have about the cake already existing in his wife's cuisine. In a letter from a mother superior in Moldavia addressed to Mrs. Pater Apor, ne Borbala Kalnoki, the writer asks Mrs. Apor to have a butler of hers taught the art of baking Kurtoskalix. Honored Mother Superior prays you if she could send you a butler in the hope perchance you spare no pain and teach him kindly some art of baking Kurtoskalix with all others." By the end of the 18th century, Kurtoskalix had become popular in all Hungarian-speaking regions as a defining element of both urban and rustic cuisine. In the first volume of A. C. K. Fold Lirasa description of the from 1868, Balaj Orban writes about the Genesis legend of Udvar Helishik, which holds that the Seklers, chased into caves and later blockaded by the Tatars, eventually made the enemy leave by presenting them a huge kurtoskalix made of straw which they held out of the cave to show they had supplies to endure the siege. Throughout the 19th and 20th centuries, the recipe of the cake was recorded in numerous popular cookbooks. As a result of urbanization at the beginning of the 20th century, Kurtoskalix was replaced by newer cakes. But on the eastern periphery of the Hungarian speaking regions, in the Seklerland, the open fireplace survived to the end of the 19th century, and consequently, Kurtoskalix has been preserved as a living tradition on regions dwelt by Seklers. Up to the present Kurtoskalix baked above cinders is regarded as imminent to the Transylvanian wedding menu. Following the change of regime in 1989, Kurtoskalix became the traditional local treat offered to Hungarian tourists visiting Sekler villages and thus an element of the international image of both the Seklerland and Transylvania. This gastronomic tradition, which earlier had been preserved merely in rural Sekler communities, gradually found its way back to the culture of the Hungarian elite, mainly due to tourism. By the middle of the 1990s, Kurtoskalix became popular in most cities in Hungary, and tourists visiting Hungary reported on the gorgeous, sweet, tubular treat with admiration. Because of international migrations and tourism, however, Kurtoskalix is also no longer regarded as a solely secular or Hungarian symbol, but rather as representative of European gastronomy. Variants. <laughs> <laughs> Three variants of Kurtoskalix can be distinguished, which are nonetheless manufactured in a similar way. The recipe of the traditional, homemade variant became standardized at the beginning of the 20th century. The ingredients are firmly specified and it is usually baked above cinders. 
The essential ingredients are exclusively, sugar, wheat flour, butter, milk, eggs, yeast and salt. Additional toppings are restricted to ground or chopped walnut, almond, cinnamon powder or vanilla sugar made from natural vanilla powder. Variants at carnivals became popular in the late 20th century. With this variant, the recipe is more flexible so that it can be manufactured in smaller, mobile places, rendering it much cheaper. In this variant, butter can be replaced by vegetable oil or margarine, and milk by milk powder. Moreover, eggs can be replaced by egg powder or liquid eggs, but this ingredient can also be omitted. In exchange, grated lemon zest, natural citrus extract or citrus juice, rum or vanilla sugar powder can be added to the dough. The surface can be provided any additional topping that bears flavor and aroma. Further alternative variants appeared at the beginning of the 21st century. These recipe can be even more flexible. The dough can be made of non-wheat flour. The inner, tubular part can be also given an additional coating, and it can abound in other natural ingredients e pieces of fruit. Alternative kurtoskalix can be prepared gluten-free as well. A cake that lacks ingredients of animal origin milk, butter, eggs can be labeled as vegan or lent. Kurtosfank, kurtosh donut is a similar shaped cake, which is baked in oil or fat and topped with sugar after baking or stuffed with whipped cream. Baking process Kurtoskalix is made of a relatively hard and dry yeast dough. A twine of dough is wrapped around the length of the spit, and then the spit with the strip of dough on it is rolled in sugar. Before or during baking, it's brushed with melted butter. The cake is ready when its surface has an even, brownish red color. Strictly, homemade kurtoskalix can be made exclusively from natural ingredients flour, sugar, milk, butter, eggs, yeast and salt. For other variants, of all ingredients it is merely margarine and vanilla sugar powder that can be synthetic, including ingredients of the final topping. Kurtoskalix can be enriched by further aromas and flavors if the completed cake is provided a final topping. Any topping can be used that does not contain salt, cheese, meat or other non-confectionary ingredients. Among pastries that are most closely related to kurtoskalix, the Transylvanian Saxon Baumstriesel has a cylinder shape, rather than a helix. Skaliki Tradelnik from Slovakia formerly Upper Hungary, as well as Trdlo, Tradelnis, Tradelnik from the Czech Moravian region, differ from kurtoskalix in that there is no caramel sugar glaze applied to their surface. Foreign names Neighboring nations have their own names for the cake. Amongst Saxons, who earlier dwelt in Transylvania, the literal translation of the word kurtoskalix, i.e. Schornsteinkuchen, became popular. Poles and Romanians use both the phonetic transcription of the word kurtoskalix and the translation of the adjective noun cluster of Magyar kalix, Hungarian kalach or CK kalix, Sekler kalach, kurtoskalic or Wegierski kolas, and respectively kolak sekiesk or kozenak sekiesk. Other languages use either a phonetic transcription of the entire compound word kurtosh kalach, or a phonetic transcription of the cluster's first element, i.e. kurtos kurtosh, followed by a translation of its second element, kalax. Cake. Topic: <laughs> Similar products around Europe. Baumstriesel in Austria, Switzerland, and Germany, not to be confused with Baumkuchen. Gâteau à la broche in France. Baumkuchen in Luxembourg, traditional dish served mostly on special occasions, such as weddings. Tradelnik in Czech Republic and Slovakia, a protected geographical indication PGI registered by the European Union Sakotis in Lithuania Bamkachinas is known in western part of Lithuania Sekic in Poland is a similar cake also cooked on a spit, normally over an open fire. Spetakaka in Sweden, a PGI registered by the EU See also List of pastries